Okay, now today what we have is we have Jeff Dion, and uh, what uh, what group do you work with here, Jeff, at I'm ABB? HB Capacitors. We're based in Quebec City, and we sell for both Canada and U.S., and Mexico, and all Latin America. So high voltage high capacitors. Voltage capacitors. That's what it looks like. So, so th this is a high voltage capacitor. That's a high voltage unit capacitor. Right there. Okay. Machine that will be a fuseless unit. Uh huh. We show you an externally fused unit on the other side. Okay. And basically, this bank will have around 100 kV uh, purpose. Okay. Okay. Uh huh. And now, so what is in this case here is the the main purpose for power factor correction? That would be the typical power factor correction one. If you would need to correct some harmonic problem, you could have a reactor in front or on top of the of your bank and you would get rid of your harmonic problem. Okay. Um, speaking of harmonics, we had an application where we had some VFDs. They were on a remote location. And come to find out, there was a 12th harmonic that was coming into the drive, and it was causing excessive over-voltage faults, nuisance faults. And it was, someone, I don't recall who, tra or found out that ultimately it was a blown fuse on a capacitor. Sure. So in this case here, because I know that that has happened at one of my customers, could you show us, do, do these capacitors have fuses on them? Those tools would be like this, so with the ejector spring you would have your your wire being out, so you would lose a complete unit of your capacitor bank. So the wire literally melts and yeah. springs out? Yeah, melts inside and springs out, so you lose completely a unit. Okay. Then the problem would be you would have an overvoltage because your bank would not be that well tuned to what you wanted. That 12 oh, hour. okay. Now in this case, with what we're looking at, what, what kind of voltage and current uh, uh, would we, are we looking at here? This one would be a typical uh, 15 kV bank. Uh, okay, uh huh. 3.6 uh, megabar, uh, around 100 amp. Bank, 100 amps, uh huh. Yep. Okay, let me just step back for just a moment to give somebody a, a, an idea of what we're talking about in terms of size. So, so, so that's a pretty, pretty big unit, and just so that people can see, here's some other ones in a different fashion. And uh, over there, do you know this other product, that one, Jim? Of course, yeah, we'll have to transfer you to our mountains and police. Okay. Okay, Jeff, thank you very much. I appreciate your time, and my customers do also.